We shouldn't have detoured. We had to. It was the only way we could find enough food. Yeah, and look at the shit we're in now. Enough. Listen, how far are we from downtown? Probably just a few miles if we're still in North Seneca. All right. Nick, you take Amy. See if you can find a secure house, okay? David, you're with me. We'll meet in that parking lot down the street in about a half hour, okay? Stay here, I'm gonna see if I could get in.
doing? We don't need this. Let's go. Anything? Gun for the princess. Other than that, same old crap. You know, anything we find is going to be useful, Nick. I guess. So, what's the plan? All the exits secured? Yep. All good. Oh, good. So, it looks like we're staying here tonight. What? No, 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 no. That, that sounds like a bad idea. They're right there. They're right outside. Why don't we just wait it out, and they might scatter. Well, in any event, what I found, this will pick up any broadcasts on any of the civilian frequencies, so maybe we might get another broadcast from that base that we heard. You really think they're still out there? I don't know. I hope so, but any news is going to be good news. There's just someone left alive out there. Well, we better bunker down. Right. Who's got first watch? Now. How's your rounds? You see anything? I thought we saw a few on the trees, but they don't look like they were heading anywhere, so just keep an eye out. Gotcha. See you guys in an hour. Yeah, be safe, bro. Everything all right? No, not really. We're running low again. I thought Thomas was in charge of that. I thought so, too. <sighs> Speak of the devil. What happened? What's going on? Last night we got caught at the mall. Yeah. Hey! Captain Fausto! This is Captain James Marcus of the United States military. We are stationed at Shelter 327 in the center of Buffalo. Six weeks ago, the outbreak originated north of the border of the country. It's now consumed over three quarters of the continent. We've lost contact with our command. We've abandoned our post. By all means, stay away from the city. The city belongs to the dead now. Find safety in numbers. Head west. You kill them in our camp now, Tom? You brought them here? What am I supposed to do, Daniel? Leave them there? You're supposed to worry about the safety of this camp, Tom! You better watch your words, boy. Look, you two, stop it. Enough of this. They said they're still around Buffalo. Maybe, but they won't last much longer. I know what you're thinking, Mike. It's not a good idea. But they have gear for us, guys. Stuff that we can use here. Yeah, what kind of stuff? Like guns, ammo, stuff like that. It was hell going through Lackawanna last night. It's like, it's like these things are getting faster and they're moving south. 
Yeah, and we are south, Tom. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. But what if they have stuff that we need? Soldiers might not be there, but there's still stuff that we can grab, stuff that we need here at camp. All right, who's going then? I'll go. But I can't go alone. I mean, I'm gonna need help, so, you know, someone's gotta come with me. There might be a lot of stuff to carry. Looks like I'm going. You don't have to if you don't want to. I know, but I think it's worth the risk. Well, how about you guys? Dan, Phil? It's not my kind of adventure. Same for me. But I'm not gonna let you go. It's us then. Let's go. Do you really think my parents made it to the base? I don't know. But all I know is it's been four hours since we last heard on your broadcast. It doesn't seem right, you know? It didn't even sound like they were in any danger. Maybe they're looking for somewhere else. Maybe. a few miles from that base. I think we got a good shot at finding gear, supplies, maybe even other survivors and your parents, if we take our chances. Do you really think we could make it that far? As long as they wander off by morning, we can make it out of here. No problem. I know my parents are alive. I just hope you're right. I know. So do I. We'll just have to wait till morning and we'll, we'll tell them. We should probably start getting some rest. Okay. Good night. Sleep well. Hey Carl, what route are they taking? We're going to have them cut out through Boston. From there they're going to go straight to Hamburg and jump on Route 5. That'll take them along the lake. Then they're going to go over from Lake Street up through Blaisdell. They're going to follow South Park and have it branch to the city near Seneca and Swan Street, where the base should be. Uh, you know, I've been thinking, they need one more person. This is just too big for two people. And actually, I, was, I lived in Blaisdell. I know the area well, so I, I'm, I'm going with them. I'd feel safer if you weren't. Yeah, I know. And it may be good to see my house, but as I probably told you, I don't know I have my family, but probably give me some closure. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just run it by them on the way. Yeah. I'm sure, I'm sure Michael would not mind. All right. You're going to need a gun. There you go. Let's take care of her, all right? All right. See you soon, man. Come with us? Oh yeah, come my car anyways. Alright. Take care of him, man. Oh, maybe I'll be back in a few days. Want me to be back here? Beer'd be great. Guns would be good too. Alright, man. Give an eye out. Are you guys going to be good for that long? Yeah, I, I think two days would be enough to pack the car with beer and food. You know, it'll be worth it. Take care, though. Just good luck, guys. Thank you. I don't want you going, but we need this. We'll see you soon.
Yeah, good luck, guys. Really. Man, I am hungry. Maybe we can stop for some fast food. No, I don't want to <laughs> joke about that. I'm going to kill someone for a burger. <laughs> I will murder someone right now for a burger and fries. <laughs> I will go through any drive through <laughs> Oh, good. Yes, the little things, guys. <sighs> Miss that. And this is why we make lists. Doesn't anyone ever clean up around here? <laughs> They're men. They don't know any better. <laughs> Yeah, but an empty box is still an empty box. Well, like I said, they're not women like us. <laughs> Nor will they ever be. How do they even know what to bring back? Well, hopefully Mackenzie remembers what I told her. But those boys in the city, they can stir, stir up some trouble. They don't pay attention. You're related to her, aren't you? She's my stepdaughter. And what about her dad? Somebody she really didn't deserve, poor girl. How much uh, water do we have? Oh gosh, I don't know, maybe two dozen on the things? Oh, okay. I don't know, something like that. Okay. Good. I'm getting real tired of this, man. <laughs> Me too. Right here, halfway. Oh, camp here for a little bit. Which seems like yet? oh, it's just checking a couple cars over right. there. I mean, this neighborhood seems pretty quiet. So split up, you know. Just check a couple houses around here. Scavenge for what we can, and then by tomorrow we'll be there. How do you want? I want to take a, take a walk up to here to Blaisdell. There's um tons of neighbors up there. It's actually, where I live, there's tons of houses there. Blaisdell. Dude, I, yeah, we can split up, but I don't mean you walk by yourself five miles down the road. I mean, I check that house, you check that house. Not go off miles down the road on your own. It's my family house, man. I, I gotta know what happened to my family. No, I, see, I understand that, but we need to stick together. You going off by yourself that far is not safe. Right, you don't understand. You have closure. You don't have any family. How are you gonna say I have closure? Look, man. Can you just stick to the plan? This has always been my plan, man. You know what? I can't stop you. You gotta do what you gotta do. Contact me in the walk, you'll see in an hour. Just be quick, man. They don't wanna be here forever. We're gonna check these houses and make moves.
Good start. Who wouldn't say so? Think she's dead? Yeah. Alright, there might be more, so just keep moving. Seriously, be careful. Alright. I think it's clear. Alright, you check in here. I'm gonna keep going. Okay.
doing out here? Hey, you needed some alone time. It's not a good idea for a long time. Look, Becca, you kid, you don't know what kind of shit you're getting into here. Hey, sorry. Whatever.
okay, buddy. <laughs> oh, buddy, it's okay. You know, it's scary out here right now. Let's see if right now you're okay. Be right back, okay? Where are you going? Give me that. I got this one, Cat. No! No! Kill it. No! 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 Let me go! I'll take that, Cat. No! Give me your back. No! 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 This? This is what you're worried about? No! no this world has no room for a pretty little princess and her little toys. We're gonna let you turn. Maybe, as the undead, you'll be better equipped to handle this world. Grab her gear, let's get out of here. Got it. No! I don't think there's anything in here. There's food in here. I don't like this. I was thinking something's not right. He, the way he looked at us, he glared at us when we first met him. Yeah. When someone goes by the city, I see it right. We know the campus, he doesn't know where he can track us. Okay. Let's start getting some of the food. All right. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. Want some soup? I'm good. Got some bottles of water for a later.
Guess what? Anything good? Got some chips. Some water. That's good. Mama? Yeah. Um, not shocking. Nice. I want to see where it came from. Nobody likes mushroom soup. Jack does. No way, not for me. You think this is how it's gonna be from now on? For me? I mean, all our friends, family, everything we love is gone. Everything we know is just, it's gone. And we sit here every day looking for cans of mystery food and but to continuously keep looking just to survive. Are you proud of that? All the good looking guys are dead. what you do to survive. So, and tomorrow, I'm going into the city. I'm going to see how bad things are in there. I need to know if the three of you are going to be ready for this. Yeah, but we will be. Good. So I've seen a lot of people die. A lot of them are good people. A lot of them are my friends. The city's lost to the dead. The virus just took it over. Remember, we're going in there for two things only. Supplies, and get the hell out. We're not going in to retake the city. You don't think we haven't lost people too? We've all lost people we care about. We, we all lost people we love. We might not have seen everything that you've seen, but know that this has been hell for anyone who's made it this far. Anyone who survived still. It hasn't been easy. I was there when it started. I saw some random guy just tear into another one. That was the first incident. And then I've seen it multiply, and I've seen it go into hundreds, almost thousands, of people going after one living person. It's not pretty. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy, I'm saying it's a warning, because we don't stand a chance against those things. Not an entire city. I know how to survive. That's it. Well, if I could have died back there, why did you save me? Because I saw that you needed the help as much as I did. And plus, that base probably has a few things I can use too. Oh, so. Thank you. I, thank you. I do appreciate that. Don't mention it. Just get some sleep. Yeah. You've got a long day tomorrow, so I'll take the first watch. All right. All right. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, sleep if you can. Start getting tired. Just let me know, and I'll take the second. Thanks. It's not a feast, but we're gonna have to do without coffee pots and toaster from now on. We're out of coffee too? Yeah, don't tell Phil or Thomas that, and I have a heart attack. I can keep a secret. Just don't let them know we're out of crackers too. 
I don't know, just what I was looking for. Hey, how's it going? Hey, Jess. Hey. Mandy, Mike and the others should be back soon. Yeah, I hope they bring that alcohol. Oh, really? Yeah, I thought you had a gun. Yeah, but I like this better. It doesn't make any noise when you shoot it. True. It must be hard to pull it back all the time. <laughs> now, watch this. Yeah, maybe be a little <laughs> bit more careful. Hey, I give her credit. At least she didn't hit Thomas. I, I'll get better sooner or later. Hey, what's up, man? I'm gonna go get some rest. I'll take over now. Yeah, that's fine. It's been pretty quiet anyways. Hey, you know what? Actually, I never got to ask you. You get the clothes you need. So, uh, thanks for letting me do that. Yeah, you alright? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. Sure? Yeah. Alright, man. Get some rest, man. where the transmission is said to go. Check it out. Go up, follow close, okay? You jacked the golf on us. I never thought you'd do something like that. Don't worry about it. Situations like this will bring out the worst in people. Move on. You sure you want to do this? This can go very wrong. You gotta see if that broadcast is legit. Yeah. How many men were compromised? We have two, but. Damn it! We can't spare two men. If we're gonna keep this pace. We can't be driving left and right. We lost contact with HQ last night. We're on our own. We need to get all these sick out of here.
light. Nobody's gonna make it through that tower. They're on the back for the rest of the stop. Let's move! Shouldn't be. Remember, go inside, get what you need, get out. How long do you think we have? Less than a minute. All right, ready? Okay. Let's go. Hey, can you check these doors again? Okay. Washington's gone. We're on our own. There's no more base, there's no more headquarters. We've got to find some place to go. We don't know where this originated. We're not military anymore, we're mercenaries. It's all about survival. Cap, I understand it, but what we need to do is we need to still establish some sort of organization for us. We need to find somewhere we can store some ammo and get some resources together. We can't do this with running on what we have. Private Stevens is already out there. He's already found some survivors in a camp. They have supplies. Yeah, but how do we know those guys aren't even infected? They're our men, they're trained, they know what they're doing. It doesn't matter if it's man, woman, or child. We take them down, we take their supplies, and we regroup. That's why you're the man in charge, Cap. I like the way that you think. I gotta be quick. Find what you can, in and out. Sweet. What'd you find? A rifle. Yeah, grab that ammo for sure. Here.
Yep. Why would they just start shooting at us like that? I don't know, but we do need to get the hell out of here. What's in the bag? Not enough. But Michael, the others, we can't just leave them up there like that. They're gonna be back soon. And if they're smart, they'll run too. They're gonna think all of us are dead, man. All of us. I saw some others running towards the trees too. Maybe they had the same idea as us. First, we gotta fend for ourselves. 18 Mile Creek isn't that far away. We'll follow that till we get to the lake and then. We'll figure out something there. It's just us and them. Alright? We can't even consider going back now. Why don't we go back? Go back? Like in the car? Yeah. It'll be safer. We'll, we'll have something protecting us. No, no, but it'll just draw more attention. You saw what, the, what was happening at the base. It was getting overrun. There's no way we can go back. We have to. We have to give him a chance. He helped us. He helped I know us. he helped us, and I, I'm grateful, but he, we don't have any of the stuff he's wearing. He has a way better chance than we do, and you saw what happened. What are we gonna do? We're just, we're just endangering ourselves then. We got people back at the camp that's, they're counting on us. We can't go back, we can't.
Mackenzie!
head. What are we gonna do? Michael. What? What are we gonna do? The radio's dead. What are we gonna do? Why do you ask me? I don't have all the answers. I don't... You're the leader on no. this mission. And I fucked up, okay? You're the strongest person I know right now. You're all I have. This whole mission was a mistake. We, we, we fucked up so bad.